Hey guys, it's Judge. Alright, so this is outing number three for my Bush Class Basic. And uh, today I decided to make it all about doing tarp shelters. This is, uh, this Kelty tarp is actually the first real tarp I've ever had. As a matter of fact, I think it might be more expensive than both my hammocks combined. That's sad. And anyway, I got it because uh, I have a couple of buddies who've had these Kelty tarps. Um, it's a pretty well thought out design. I kind of wish I'd bought the first gen that had sort of the more neutral tan color, but this green's not bad. Um, and uh, so what I'm doing is setting up here is just, this would be kind of my standard hammock configuration with an A-frame. I'm sort of extending it out a little bit because, well, it's a nice day and that's what I would do. So because I have a real tarp, I want, and it's big enough, I got the 10 by 12, I thought I could go ahead and rearrange it, drop it down a little bit, it's got enough length that I could stake down some midpoints, and then would have flaps for, you know, if the weather starts getting nasty, and we're coming into fall and winter here in the Pacific Northwest, and uh, my favorite times to camp, and it's going to rain and or snow on me. So... I've never done this configuration before. I knew what I was looking for. And the biggest thing was dealing with, uh, you know, how to work with what came, basically everything I'm using except for the Ridgeline came with this tarp. And just figuring out how to tie everything down. Um, I did end up getting rid of the little plastic slidey things everybody wants to give you. And uh, just, I just use taut line hitches all the time. So learn your knots, because the knots will do you better in the long run. So uh, let's see here. Getting, uh, getting some stakes so I can pin the edges back. And then I got some more video coming right now. That'll show you a bit of the interior. And I really dig this. Um, I'm going to have to dig the hammock out and put it up like this because this will be really pretty nice this winter, I think. Go a little wider, too. So that's pretty much it. Once I get the hammock and live in it, it'll be just a matter of... Uh, making adjustments from there, but no, I got the basics. And finally, just your basic lean-to. I had enough room, I could make a really pretty spacious accommodation. Um, really, none of these are kind of foul weather, I want to be low to the ground, conserve as much heat setups. Um, I was just kind of having fun with it. So, like I said, I've always been Mr. $8 blue tarp guy, and uh, I was pretty excited to start seeing what what a nice you know purpose made tarp can do so yeah that's how we spent the rest of the afternoon drinking cedar tea and hanging out so once again thanks for watching see you around